Welcome back, my friends. It has been a long time since I have checked in with my favorite band, family band from the Philippines, Franz Rhythm. Today we are going to be watching their Losing My Religion R.E.M. cover. Uh, that is a song from the 90s that uh, was very, very big. Uh, or at least that's when I heard it. It was in the 90s. Uh, by the way, I've been cataloging my journey throughout my life of uh, the most important music and musicians and songs and bands um, that have influenced me. So that's under Brian's playlist reactions. Please check that out. Um, it's it's going to be a long one, and I'm going to be spending a lot of time on it, but it's it's for my own edification, and it's also for your enjoyment as well. But I do have to pause once in a while and get back into the ones uh, that I've been falling in love with lately on this journey of, of being a videographer, of being a, a song reactor, uh, and Franz Rhythm has definitely caught my attention, so let's get started with that, but please check out the description box below for ways to follow me outside of whichever platform that you are viewing this on, um, all the different platforms that you can find me on, and uh, ways to support the channel and Chords and Notes merch. So, this is from one month ago at the time of this recording, and they have 223,000 views on it, so good job, guys. Franz Rhythm is the website, the YouTube channel that you can find this on as well. Here we go. It looks a little bright for you guys. So I'm going to drop the brightness in the black light down, backlight down a little bit.
That's it. That's it. That was it. Very cool. Very cool indeed. So we had uh, many stringed instruments there. So Dad was playing the five string bass, sounded great. Dodds was doing a really good job on the drums. He's coming along. He's coming along as a as a drummer. Um, Char, she had a twelve string electric, so very nice. Uh, capo down the third fret, and Chen uh, was that. I'm trying to remember. There's a mandola and there's a mandolin, and this was an eight string. Which, oh, the four string is is the ukulele, right? So then the eight string is the mandolin. I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. I forget. Uh, but she did a really good job on that instrument as well. And that was also capoed at the third fret. So um, same tuning, but different octaves, right? Um, I liked it. It was good. It was, I think the vocals could have been a little more forceful and out front. But it was, you know, it was just seemed kind of subdued and, and, and chill for the vocal lines. Uh, but the girls harmonized really well with one another. And Dad, when he came in, you know, had a, added a little bit more of that depth um, to the vocals. Uh, but well rehearsed, well practiced, um, well played. Definitely a, a good version of a, of a famous song. Um, pretty much spot on. Right, I don't. I didn't notice anything that would tell me that it was that they made their own interpretation of certain parts. I haven't heard the original in a long time, but I heard it so many times that I would think that I, you know, I might pick up on something. I may have missed something, so you guys let me know. Uh, but yeah, definitely, you know, just another wonderful uh, journey into a family that's full of love and loves the Lord and is sharing their musical gifts and talents with the world. What's not to like? You know, so great job. Great job, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. God bless you. Jesus loves you. I will talk to you later.